if you want your 3D printer to last and you want to have the best prints possible, you need to lubricate your lead screws. The lead screws in this case here are on the left, on the right and in the back of the printer. The first thing you need to do is you need to clean the lead screws and take the old grease away. There might be particles from the PLA, ABS or from ASA or any other material stuck in that grease. So you want to remove as much as possible first before you put on a fresh coat of, in this case, silicone lubricant grease. Let me show you how that works. So the first thing you want to do is take a paper towel and remove the existing grease. And you can see how it comes off just by, you don't want to go up and down because then you're just going to tear the paper towel. So you're kind of like padding from one side to another. Once the lead screws are clean, you want to take this grease and put it all over the crew. Now you don't need to put too much on there. Now the good thing on this grease is it's also food grade. That doesn't mean that you can eat it, but it means that you can use it when you're printing something that afterwards has to be food grade. And in this case, let's say you're using uh, PLA, which PLA is food grade, so you can use that. Or uh, if you use ASA, that is food safe, you can use that too. And you don't have to worry about any part of the printer that would make it not food grade anymore. Once you're done, you're going to move the bed all the way down and then you put some more of the grease on there too. And I like to do it kind of double coated because I don't use too much. So I can put some more on right now. And this is how easy and fast it is to lubricate the lead screws of a 3D printer. I can highly recommend using that super loop. It's a perfect greasy consistency and works perfect for all my 3D printers.